Hi guys, today I have a Dollar Tree and Office Depot haul. I'm gonna get started with the Office Depot stuff first and then I'll share with you what I got at the Dollar Tree. So first I went to Office Depot and they had some penny deals so I picked some up. You obviously have to spend $5 to get the penny items so I tried to get a few extra things. I saw that they had these flare pens for $8 and I've never tried these before and I've heard lots of teachers rave about them so I thought I would pick them up and see what all the fuss was about so I picked up a pack of those they were eight dollars on sale and I'll put the week that these sales are going on down below so you know if this is still going on when you watch the video I got that and then I got this pack of index cards it has 300 cards in there and they are blank I'm not sure if they had any uh, ruled ones so I didn't really look but I did get a pack of the blank ones and these were a dollar and then they had the sharpies all the different colors two for 50 cents so i just got two black ones because these are the ones i need the most so i just stuck with that and then the rest of the items i got were penny items so the glue sticks were a penny they had purple blue and clear so i got the purple ones kids seem to like those more and they can see where they're putting their glue so i got three of those that was the limit I got three composition notebooks these were also a penny and then I got three packages of these large pink erasers also a penny so that is it for Office Depot let's get on to the Dollar Tree so here's what I got at the Dollar Tree first I'll show with you this because I already opened it it's just a little pill container and I got this to put my various pills in um, just in case it's good to have all different types of pills in your teacher bag just in case you need them, you have them. So I thought this would be good to keep them organized. And I'll share that more in detail once I set up my teacher bag for this year. I got two packages of these emoji band-aids. And I know I said I wouldn't get character band-aids, but I don't know. These were too cute to pass up. And I thought I could just have them on hand. So I got two boxes of those. Then I found the tweezers, and these are pretty good heavy duty tweezers. Um, I'd seen them in different videos and just didn't realize how good they are, but these are a very nice quality. So I got these, I got four of them because my table, the max they have is four students. So I got four of those for using some centers. Uh, I got these, I also got a, there it is, I got this one as well. And I thought, this is for large room decor, but I thought this would be nice to give um, as a positive note every once in a while. So this one has these three. It has reaching new heights, tremendous job, intense work, and we all have good points. So I got that one, and then I got this fruit one. It says one in a melon, orangey great, and very nice. And then I got this calendar. You can just stick in your binder. It has all the way up to 2018. I got the gray one. And I thought this would be good to put with my small group binder. And I'll just put what groups I see on each day or for assessing. Then I picked up some vinyl letters to make some extra letters for my light box. So I got the letters. And then I got these report covers so I can cut them out. And lastly, I got this classroom decor kit. Um, I don't know what I'll use it for, but picked it up. It says swim for success. And it has the border and the little fishes. And that was a dollar. And it has one die cut poster, 12 shaped decor sheets, and 10, 11, or 10 wall borders. So that is my Office Depot and Dollar Tree haul. And thank you for watching. Bye.